In this video, we're going to be looking at the latest update on Tail Feed. First, how to create a post. You come up here and you click Create. Tailfeed makes it incredibly easy for creators to write and format their posts. Simply select the suitable options from the formatting toolbar in your editor and make your content more presentable and stylish to your readers. You can now embed videos and can search and upload royalty free images from Unsplash with a single click to add an image or embed a video. Click on the plus icon in the editor and make your post more visually appealing. Now we come to write. Now we click on the plus icon. Now latest update on Tail Feed. Now you can search for images. So let me show you can search for images on Tail Feed from Splash. Click on it. Now you type what you're looking for, uh, the picture you're looking for, either a flower or a man. There's anything. After typing it, you click on the search magnifying glass right here then you see all your pictures all the pictures that appear then you can click on it to use any of the pictures to so just click on it and boom you have a picture inserted into your post now I'm going to show you you can upload pictures into your post so we come down Move our cursor down, press space. So we have our plus, click on it to so upload a picture to Tail Feed. Just click upload image, then look for the images you want to use. Click on this, then click, and boom, you have your image. If you want to add a line break to your text or underneath your image, just click line break right here and we have a straight line. If you want to embed a video link into your video, you can do that by clicking embed a video. All you need to do is click on it. Then we have this extra menu that appears up here. So I'm gonna look get a link of a video. Okay, we've gotten the link. Then we paste it in here and click OK. And that's it. Our video has been embedded into our post. Emoticons are an integral part for many people to communicate their thoughts more efficiently and now you can add them to your post on Tfeed by clicking on the emoji icon on the top right corner. The other new features on Tfeed now we have emoji, different emojis of food, house, um, ball, Warning signs. If you want to add code snippets or a single line code, Tfeed now provides an option to add inline code and code blocks from the formatting toolbar. You can also type in code if you're writing a post about a programming language. You can type in a code by using code block. First, we come down and click on code block so if you're writing an article about programming language and you want to show an example a snippet of the code you can use code block if you just want to post a single line code you can only use inline code now I do advise you to type in your code or even if you want to copy it like this copy then paste in 
you're gonna have to edit it arrange everything because it's not going to arrange it for you you can look at it right here so this has to be rearranged again or I try to just type it yourself to make it more easier a power failure or your system hanging can be extremely inconvenient to ensure you don't lose your data in such cases Safefeed has launched the auto save feature which as the name suggests will automatically save your work and also Tfida comes with a auto save option so once you are typing whatever if your system goes off or anything happens to your system your article or your post will not be lost if you look at this it's not saving so when I type it saves everything I'm typing in every minute we have now updated the editor's platform to include two options for headings H1 and H2. You can have one for your title and have one for your subtitle. That's great. First update is now we have each header 1 and we have an header 2. Hey, if you've not subscribed to my channel, please go ahead and do. What are you waiting for? Just click the red button underneath the video. Uh,